Hey everyone, Mike Rivola here alongside the Rapids legend, Drew Moore. And Drew, the 2024 schedule just dropped. So we're gonna let you guys know, fill you in on some of the important dates to keep an eye on for 2024, particularly Rocky Mountain Cup. And of course, 4th of July, we'll get to that in a bit, but just a few dates to make a note of. We'll start off with going to Cincinnati this year. The last time that the Rapids went to Cincinnati was in 2021, earning a two nil win, but obviously a different Cincinnati side compared to 2023, where they turned out to be the Supporters Shield winner. So that'll be a tough match in 2024. A big one, of course, going to Miami this time around with a certain Lionel Messi managed by Tata Martino alongside Jordi Alba and Sergio Busquets. The Rapids will open the 2024 season at the Portland Timbers at Providence Park. They will close out the season at Austin FC, just as they did in 2022 when they earned a last minute draw, making it a 2-2 result against the Verde and Black. And then of course the Rapids home opener here at Dick's Sporting Goods Park in 2024 will be against Nashville SC on March 2nd. Now, Drew, let's talk about a couple things of note. Rocky Mountain Cup, and then of course, 4th of July. Let's start with Rocky Mountain Cup, Drew. Um, that is something where the Rapids haven't had too much luck in the past few years, but with Chris Armas coming to the fold, making it clear he wants to make that a priority and earn that back for the club, for the fans, more importantly. I mean, how important is, is this Rocky Mountain Cup for the Colorado Rapids in this day and age? Rocky Mountain Cup, it continues to be extremely important for, for both sides, Real Salt Lake and, and the Rapids. And when the schedule comes out, first of all, it, it's so exciting when the schedule is released. And it's almost overwhelming because you start scrolling, right? And, and you look at everything. And, and five minutes later, after you set your phone down, you pick it back up and scroll back through again, you know. But RSL, the Rocky Mountain Cup games are always top of, of the Rapids list. And, and I think they start with the first two games of, of the series on the road. So it'll be a big test. And, and Chris Armas knows MLS rivalries extremely well, having been a player in this league, having coached in this league now. He knows all the rivalries. He, know, he will know how important this match is for both fan bases. He will share that with the players. Those will be, as they always are, extremely focused and important weeks of training leading up to those matches. But you, you take it one match at a time. And, and the first one is, I believe, March 9th at Real Salt Lake. Uh, you know, get ready for for an early an early derby uh, in the season. I like that, um, and it'll be important to to as it always is to both clubs. And as Drew mentioned, there that the first one will be on March 9th, and that is part of the first four games that the Rapids have. Three of them will be on the road. One of those will be at Real Salt Lake. There will be two others with the second one being at RSL on May 18th. The third one being here at home at Dick Sporting Goods Park on July. 20th. So that covers Rocky Mountain Cup. Um, of course, as you mentioned, uh, very important for, for the club, obviously with Chris coming in, trying to make sure he makes a point of it and, and earn that Rocky Mountain Cup back for the club and particularly for the fans. Let's move on to 4th of July, Drew. That's always, that's a big spectacle that this, per, the, this, this club takes a lot of pride in being able to make an event of not the weekend of the 4th of July, not the day before 4th of July, but on the 4th of July, have a game here at Dick Sporting Goods Park and be able to celebrate that with fans here at our home stadium. You have been a part of many of those as a player. I mean, how special is it to, to be a part of something so unique here, especially here at the Colorado Rapids? The 4th of July game is is amazing. It's it's probably my favorite game of, of the regular season. Obviously you have you have the, the opening match day here and, and there's some other, you know, the, the rivalry matches and stuff. But 4th of July has an, an added atmosphere and just, just specialness to it. Uh, and I expect it to be no different uh, here in 2024 with SKC coming into into town, a, a club that the Rapids know extremely well, uh, a manager in Peter, Peter Vermees, who was a Rapids player. Um, but just the atmosphere, the you know the the pageantry. Fourth of July is my my favorite holiday. Um, and since I was traded here in in 2009, it was very clear how important the getting the the Fourth of July match here, which which the Rapids do every single season um, at home, is amazing. So another one to look forward to, and the weather will be absolutely perfect. Yep, fingers crossed that of course the weather is is uh, on our side on the Fourth of July. Of course, in 2023 that it wasn't so favorable, but hopefully fortunes change for the Rapids in terms of the weather, and then of course results. Uh, leading up to that and of course that fourth of july match is against skc it kicks off a three game home stand uh closing out that home game stand against the new york red bulls just something of note chris armis's former team that he managed a few years back so that does it in terms of looking at some of the important dates for 2024 make sure you circle them on your calendar now ready to go so tune in to those matches in 2024 to cheer on your colorado rapids